Hello Internet. This is going to be a quick and easy video on how to download your Wii save files. No homebrew, no hacking, just drag and paste. All you're going to need is an SD card, preferably under 8 gigs. Doesn't matter if it's HDSC or whatever. So let's dive right in. So, first thing you're going to do is uh, open up your browser. I'm going to go ahead and go to GameFAQs. And, uh, you know, they've been the homies a long time. These are going to be some very old posts that you're going to be bringing up. So you're going to go to More Systems, find the Wii. Uh, you know, you're going to use a search engine or find what game you're looking for to download the Wii saves. As you can see, not every game has Wii saves. <clears throat> but um, I do believe you can... Uh, upload your own saves so that everybody else can uh, utilize them so that's pretty cool uh, today we're gonna be looking for Kirby's Dream Collection Special Edition I need everything unlocked in those let's see so you click on that uh, most of the time there will be different uh, regions you wanna find your region in my case North America you got the uh, creator that uploaded it file size and the download link is right here the game code is uh, it's always going to be right here all North American games end with the letter E and you want to remember that because you have to name a file uh, later that exact thing for it for each game that you do so uh, go ahead and go to save game file and download that and then uh, show and finder. It's right here. Now it's going to come up on a bin file. Not sure how it is on Windows, but uh, should just be able to extract it and everything be fine. Um, so this is the bin file. If you do have Mac, you don't have to do anything extra. Uh, just going to go ahead and open your SD card. I already have a file here, but ignore this. We're going to start from the top as if we were doing this from a clean memory card. So your your memory card will only have one of these folders and it only needs one of these folders. Uh, so like I said, ignore this this private one right here. So you're gonna create a file. You're gonna name this one private. All right. Oh. Nah, not too worried about it. Rename it private. You're going to open that folder, create another folder, name that folder Wii, open that folder, create another folder, and uh, you're going to put the word title. Open that folder, create a new folder, and this is where you're going to put your game uh, code name. And uh, this will not work if you do not do this step. So for each game, each game has a different code and different different for uh, different regions, excuse me. So you're gonna copy that code and that is uh, what you're gonna name this file. All right. All right, now that you have uh, all those set up, you're just going to, Go ahead and uh, go to where you downloaded your uh, Wii save. Go ahead and pull that. I'm just going to drag mine to the desktop. Easy, uh, accessible. And uh, go to your SD card. Open up the folders all the way to the game you want to open. And uh, drag that bin f uh, folder into there. And that is the Wii save right there. Now uh, you need to rename this data so it says data.bin so no matter what game you uh, do choose every time the last folder should be the uh, game save and you have to rename it data.bin alright and then uh, after that you're going to eject the SD card put it in the Wii and I'll see you over at the Wii alright now that we're back on the Wii all you want to do is go to your Wii options, 
select data management followed by save data we and now if you already have saved data for your game that you that you want to transfer the we save to uh, you're gonna have to delete that so I recommend backing that up somewhere if you don't want to lose your personal progress uh, I'm just gonna delete mine so erase yes all right and now we go to our SD card uh, depending on how big your SD card is uh, it might take a few seconds to come up all right now we're going to select and just copy and copy to Wii system memory Back to the main menu and we'll test this out. Start of the game. And as you can see, 100% completed, and that's what the Wii save was, 100% complete on all these games on here. So uh, very useful if you're trying to unlock stuff uh, fast, maybe unlock some things in multiplayer so they can utilize with some local play. Uh, it's a big benefit from it. Alright, we'll uh, see you guys in the next video. Enjoy!